Hello, this is how to do the spectrum analyzer on Rangelink. So um, I guess, so the first thing as far as wiring goes, so this is just a USB hub that I have. Anyways, this is plugged into an FTDI adapter. And then, so uh, you power the receiver. Um, the pinout on the receiver is wrong, um, at least on the one I have. You're going to want to go to the manual to check the correct pinout. Um, anyway, so I have this hooked up. And uh, on the bottom of the receiver, so with the antenna ports facing up, on the bottom is channel 1, on the top is channel 2. And then, so channel 1 is hooked up to TX, and channel 2 is hooked up to RX. Channel 1 is the blue, channel 2 is the green. Um, and then I just got that powered. So anyways, what you do is you plug this in, and then you open up your rangeling folder. Um, in the V2.10, so, sorry for this getting out of focus and everything, I'll do the best I can. In the V2.1 folder um, is JFPV V1.0. Open that up, then uh, go to Spectrum Analyzer. And then, so that's what the Spectrum anal Analyzer looks like. So then you're going to want to plug in your thing. Um, and then on the receiver, there's a little button right here. You're going to want to hold this button. First the blue LED will come on, then the red, then let go. This puts it in uh, the correct mode. Um, so the blue light is, the first light is solid, the second light is um, flashing. And then you're going to want to, it's all connected right now, so you're going to want to select your COM port. And then hit start. So there is your spectrum analyzer. And uh, I do have a little spike in the middle. Um, nothing is turned on right now. And you can see the noise level is about negative 96, 90, like maybe 100. Um, and then I'll go ahead and turn on my quad and you can see it go up. Um, I don't have props in my quad and I'm going to put the camera down for just a second. Okay, so my quad is on. And then, so you can see the noise level is up a little bit. I have it about six feet away, or no, three feet away. Let me go like this. Actually, no, that's a bad idea. And then if I move it closer, right on top of the antennas, you can see it goes up a significant amount. So yeah, that's the spectrum analyzer. And the nice thing is that it's constantly scanning like this, so you can see how it changes over time. And then on the bottom, you have your frequency. Um, so I can change this, I think, to, well, yeah, there's a little adjuster right there. You can mess with that setting. Um, otherwise, that's basically it.